Super thin barrel, it's on there. It is. Yeah. I'll tell you what. Cheers, Dave. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I thought you sent your photo. And, uh, ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce you to Dave Barrel. it's been in the GRS stock, beautiful kit, but we wanted to make this more modular. So what we've done is we've taken and built a whole chassis around this gun. It would also fit a Pantera Dynamic, it would also fit in this, in this uh, chassis. So we've got a full length Arca Swiss, built in Picatinny, m lock slots. We've got AR-15 style grip, so you can switch that out. We've got an AR-15 style buttstock, so you can unscrew this and put on whatever buttstock you'd like. 
this butt stock, it's, we came up with a switch system to be able to adjust it up and down, back and forth, and then we've got up and down adjustment here as well. Uh, bubble level, uh, super, super robust, solid, solid uh, chassis. We're hoping to have them done by April. That's awesome. So, is it this will fit the Pantera? Yep. Pantera Hunter? Yep. Awesome. That means more money to Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> this is truly tremendous looking right if you look at this. Obviously it's all based on the King, but obviously like you say, it's the Pantera, the Dynamic. Yep. What a fantastic addition. Right, I'm here with Chris at uh, Hull Coaches. He's going to run through a few bit of information on the 125th anniversary model of the limited edition. Uh, Chris, you've got the floor, mate. We've got the floor. So, we've got three right fronts to celebrate Far Out's 125 years of training. Very exciting. So, we have a 97 KT. It's got an adjustable boot pad. This beautiful grey and red laminate stock. We've got 125 years engraved in here with some engraving underneath the book and the reaction here in the limited edition these should be arriving in June so along with that we've got the 100T again lovely laminate stock got the custom engraving and again another special run of the rifles and then we've got something a little bit different we've got a 50S 50 was sort of the way to the start it all for fire out. So this is going to be just going to be more of these. And the 50S has the adjustable foresight like a 35. It's what we maybe know in the UK as a HW99. The 50 has the adjustable sights on it with the 99 just So very exciting. There's going to be 900 of these and we've got 450 of them in. And just a wonderful rifle to celebrate. Such a huge milestone of 125 years of trading. Now for me, I had a 97 Centenary Edition that they did in 1999. It was a green laminate with a stainless underlever and it came with a pen knife. It was my second air rifle. <laughs> it was my first fire arc, okay? Yeah. And I stupidly got PCP-itis and sold it. So so you'll be, buying, you'll, you'll, years you'll, later, you'll be buying one of these? Well, I'm hoping my birthday present in <laughs> September could be one of these. From Virock. <laughs> I don't know, but I am absolutely so excited to show these off. So we're, uh, they've been so well received. They certainly look a spectacular looking machine. So yeah, All right. brilliant to see you, Mick. Fantastic, Chris as normal. Take care. You take care, and we'll chat to you later. Thank you. Thanks. See you later. Out the others, I'm here with AJ from Tier One, and we've got the, the ELR bipod. ELR bipod, right? The floor is yours. Hi guys. So uh, yeah, as I said, I'm AJ from Tier One. This is our new uh, Gen Two ELR bipod. So this is really designed for the uh, the long range precision shooting guys. So uh, it's uh, a, a hugely adjustable bipod, all made from 7,075 T6 aluminium, aerospace grade carbon fiber. Anodized, hard anodized for the specs, um, incredibly stiff, incredibly rigid, um, can take a you know an absolute beating. Um, uses our um, quite unique hip adjustment system, which allows us to adjust the legs. So we go from vertical out to kind of a standard regular bipod configuration. Where we can get super wide. So if you need to get really low, or if you need to really get really stable, then it's, it's very adjustable. Um, all made in the UK, so all of our products are manufactured in-house, so we design, manufacture in-house in, uh, in Yorkshire, um, up at our headquarters, and uh, from UK source materials, so we're very proud of that. We make everything on this bipod, so every screw, every pin, all made in-house, so we're really proud of that. Excellent. So it's, uh, yeah, it's been really proving really popular. Um, like I said, this is our latest product that we've launched at the show, 
and uh, yeah, we're, we're really pleased to see how it goes. So right, nice, nice one, thanks for that, AJ. Like no you problem. say, if you, if you want to buy British, and it's totally all British, come to tier one. Absolutely. Right, yeah. nice one, mate. Yeah. Cheers, mate.